Hello guys, this is Aldek here and today um, we're going to be doing a little hybrid squad builder and uh, some goals at the end of it. Um, and yeah, so first thing I want to talk about is uh, I haven't uploaded in around two weeks, just over, just under two weeks. Um, main reason being is because, you know, I've been a little bit, um, not bored of YouTube, but I don't know, I've just been putting it off because I've not really felt like doing a YouTube video and you know different stuff like i was busy but um yeah i'm back now and i'm probably not going to be uploading daily as such um because it is the end of fifa 12 and you know it's getting a little bit boring now um but i may be uploading like every two or three days maybe if that's all right but when fifa 13 does come out i'm definitely going to be doing daily daily play I'm playing a lot of Battlefield now as well, so whether you want me to put that up on YouTube, I'm not sure, because I don't mind posting, you know, some different content, or whether you want me to make a second channel, um, but yeah, nice little hybrid year, sort of Brazil, Russian League, Premiership hybrid, but I want to talk about the keeper now, lots of people for a Brazilian keeper, you know, they pick your Julio Caesars and uh, Heltons, but my favourite keeper in the game has to be Jefferson. It's either Jefferson or Hugo Lloris, but Jefferson is an amazing keeper for me. If you haven't tried him out, guys, even if you go try the normal card out, I think he's actually got two cards. He's got a 79 non-shiny and he's got an 80 rare card. Even the 80 rare card, guys, that is such an amazing card. And I definitely, if you've got a Brazilian team or a Liga de Brazil team or just a team where he can fit in, I would definitely recommend him, guys, because he is one of my favourite keepers in the game. And he keeps loads of stuff out. And going on to the defence, we've got the two probably most overpowered centre-backs in the game, Dede and David Luiz. Nice little goal there from Dumbier, actually making him rage quit. But um, Danny Alves right back, Taiwo. I've always liked Tai Taiwo at left back, big, strong. Um, again, quite overpowered, <laughs> but uh, this team wasn't that fun. I mean, I don't really like using the 4 2 2 2 formation and the two cams, Kagua and Honda. Mm, I thought they'd be a little bit better than they were. Kagua never really got involved, and I expected them because I was playing them sort of Kagua's on the left, cut in on his right, Honda on the right, cut in on his left. I never actually got to do that, you know. Um, and you'll see a lot of headed goals from Drogba, who I will add is a beast in the air. He gets to nearly everything, and I'd probably say in the games that I played with him, he probably missed about one, two headers. He's that good, he's that consistent, he's so strong as well, he can get up for the high balls. Um, but yeah, so, I don't know, I kind of changed my game plan. I actually crossed it in with the left foot there from Honda, nice little goal. But, um, you know, like I said, I was not I was able to get some shots on target, but they weren't really working the keeper much. Because, you know, Honda, he has got one of the best long shots in the game, but I just wasn't able to utilise it. Um as such but uh, yeah i won a lot of games with this team actually and quite an enjoyable team to play with um apart from you know the formation and stuff the strike force is really really good and roberto carlos i didn't really get much long shots i think i only scored one goal or something which was there actually but um i didn't get to score much and if you're wondering what kit I'm using the pink one, I think I have used the pink one in this episode, is Malaga in the Liga BBVA, uh, it's their away kit, and this home kit here, the red and white one, is AS Monaco in the French League 2, um, I think that's the right one, but yeah, so it's coming up to the end now guys, please go follow me on Twitter, like I said, I apologise for not uploading much but um you know go follow me on twitter i'll be tweeting a lot you know about what i'm doing and stuff and you know when the giveaway comes at the end of fifa 12 i'll be tweeting about that so definitely recommend following me on there if you haven't liked the video guys and you did enjoy it please leave a like and leave a comment what you want to see on my channel there's only a couple of weeks left of fifa 12 so anything you want to see um i'll put up and yeah apart from that i will be doing a series on fifa 13 and apart from that, I'll just see you guys next time and peace out.